Now, let's swap out the soccer ball for a stick. Syracuse Field Hockey All-American Charlotte DeVries will be training with the USA Women's National Team once Syracuse's season is over. Ella Stanton dives into the challenges the USA team is facing. Look it out the center. The term hockey often refers to ice hockey in the United States. With the large popularity of the game on the ice, field hockey is less prevalent in the U.S. Field hockey is mainly played in Europe, Africa, Asia, and Australia. The United States women's national field hockey team has not had a high success rate in international play. The team participates in seven different tournaments, but has only had two first place finishes. Syracuse field hockey head coach Ange Bradley believes the reason the United States falls behind compared to other countries is because there is no group after the college environment. Right now, the collegiate level is all we have. Uh, we don't have leagues that are older, more experienced that they could see play at the next level or participate in. The recently appointed women's national team head coach announced their new roster this June. 18 out of 35 women on the roster are currently college athletes, including Syracuse offensive player Charlotte DeVries. Bradley says that this benefits but also hurts the women's national program. I think that it benefits them because you've got young kids that they can teach their own ways of how they want to play um, for the international game. I think it hurts them because they don't understand how the collegiate system works and um, the NCAA rules. Bradley thinks one thing that could help the U.S. women's team be successful is actually not to play in the U.S., but to go overseas. If they could go to another country like the Canadian women did, play um, with other clubs uh, in a different setting, I think that could maybe help them and keep them a little fresher that when they come back into training camps ready for major tournaments they're bringing a little bit more technical and tactical awareness um, from playing the game in, in different places. The team will face their first competition together this January at the Pan American Cups and attempt to qualify for the World Cup. Ellis Stanton, NCC News.